Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have something special to show you all again, since you all loved my other video on the town of Yulon. I have something else I want to show you. This is pretty cool. I know how much some of you loved my other video about the ghost town, so I've decided to make another one. And I just, I love history. And I love exploring and yeah, this is Another video on the town of Yulon. So here where I'm walking was actually the entrance to the town of Yulon. And you can sort of see the remnants of it. Just here where I'm walking. It's a little bit spooky, but I thought this is pretty cool. You can still see the lines on the road from 50, 60 years ago. And over here. So this is actually La Trobe Avenue, I believe. And I brought this photo along to just to give you all an idea of what it looked like before. So here you go. So I'll show you again. So there was actually houses along this road. People used to live here. I think my aunt said she used to walk these streets and people in their houses and it's actually very spooky. Very spooky. So I'll show you again. So I can't go any further because it's actually quite dangerous. It's hollow ground because the open cut is just actually over there. Zoom in. There we go. The big hole in the ground. So you can still see the lines on the road. <coughs> But yeah, I reckon this is probably the most fascinating part of Yellow North. This is the old trees. So these trees here, from what you can see, are probably 50 or 60 years old, even older. They've been here since the town was erect. Yeah, so quite a while. They're beautiful old trees. Yeah. Oh wow, this is actually sort of like a turning bay to turn around because the power station is over there and that's just the parking lot. You can still, if I zoom in, yeah, you can still see that there's a drain there from yesteryear. It's pretty interesting. I've said this before and I'll say it again, it would have been a beautiful place to live here. Even on a day like today, it's pretty, it's very warm. It's probably almost 35 degrees. So I'm just gonna be very quick. Show you guys around. So that was the entrance there. Give you guys an idea. So there's La Trobe Avenue there. There's the power station. The parking lot's just over there. There's some of the road, I believe. So, I don't know what that road was. Yeah, I think, gosh, these trees must be so old. <laughs> over half a century, I reckon. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful views out here, as you can see. Spectacular. I think another thing too, which I mentioned just before, is that you can still see the lines on the road where this was a road before, and there's gut, you can still see the curb as well. Yeah, <laughs> this is, yeah, just the remnants of the town. It's pretty sad. The ghost town. Gotta watch where I'm seeing sticks and stuff everywhere. I'm just standing on uh, another tree, another really old tree. It's beautiful, beautiful old trees. I'm glad they kept them. Um, yeah, as you come into Yulon North, you can go past the power station and <clears throat> you can come into the parking lot for the power station where the workers park. And if you just veer right, it will take you up to this place. You can visit it if you want, because it is actually a turning bay. 
and near the power station is the rail trail and sort of a barbecue picnic area which you can visit also it's quite nice especially on a day like today mm. so i'm just at home now <clears throat> i thought it would have been a bit too hot because it, it is pretty balmy here today um so right behind me is a map of the town i have hanging on my wall <laughs> <laughs> um, not Yulaw North, actually Yulaw when it was a town. I'll explain more about it later and I have some photos here I want to show you all, which I thought are pretty cool because I love history and I love spooky things as well. So I'll just show you a few and I'll explain the story behind them. I have here a collage of photos. Um, I just want to show you all and I'll explain the story behind them as well and what they are. So firstly, we have La Trobe Avenue, which I was just at. And over here is looking down behind La Trobe Avenue. So this would have been the entrance into Elon when it was a town. There's the power station and there's the hotel. Broadway Gardens. Broadway Gardens again and the town centre and I believe that's the post office. Streslecky Way, I think that's what it called, was called, or Streslecky Avenue, I can't remember, and I can't remember what side of the town this was on. <clears throat> town Centre, this is an aerial view of the lawn, gives you an idea of where everything was, so Broadway Gardens, Town Centre, or maybe this is Broadway Gardens, I don't know, if you live there, let me know, please. <laughs> Cinema, I remember my mum talking about it. Beautiful brick building. The hospital would have been a huge complex, as I said in my last video. I think this is where I was in my last video. This is the nurses' quarters. I think here. I'm not too sure. If you live there or work there, let me know. I'm not too sure. It could have been over here too. I think that's Purvis Road. I'm not too sure. Broadway Gardens again. Quite nice. Just some houses overlooking. This would have been the, uh, the open cut. Sorry, it's a bit bleak. It is a bit glary. So it would have been the open cut here. Just some houses. That's the post office. And that's a hospital again. So yeah, it, hospital would have been quite big. Mm. It's a map of the town. My sister gave me for Christmas as a gift. It's very nice of her to do that. <laughs> she knows how much I love history. <laughs> yeah, and just all these old street names and things like that. It's quite fascinating and I can't remember where the, the train station was. But this is just your lawn, I think, because um, you come past here and the power station would have been up over here somewhere. And yeah, I'm sort of out this way further because I live in Yulaw North. So yeah, I think, oh yeah, there we go, Yulaw North. Mm. And that's a wrap guys, thanks for watching. Tune in for more spooky videos or ghost tours. I'm gonna do more. <laughs>